Hi there, I'm Tom Monroe from Monroe Home Inspections. I'm on an inspection today of a building that was built in 1975. That building has copper piping. The copper piping is showing serious signs of deterioration. And let me show you why it's so important if you're looking to buy into a building to make sure your inspector evaluates the copper piping to see when it's going to need to be replaced throughout the building. It can be a considerable expense to the strata and ultimately to you. Let me show you. So this is where the copper piping comes into the building and you can see the color of it. It's got that green tarnished color to it. But here, see that metal cleat that's holding the actual piping to the roof, the ceiling of the parkade? Well, it's rusted. What that tells me is that's a steel actual bracket holding it. When a dissimilar metal like steel comes in contact with copper, you get galvanic corrosion. You can see also on top of this pipe, the copper's touching there as well. That's why we've got this water look running down here. So this is a sign where there's actually been leakage before. Sorry, my flashlight was in the way. So as we go through the building, this disappears into the actual mechanical room. As that pipe comes out of the mechanical room, you can see more green corrosion on the pipe on the right. You can see that tarnished look still. All that corrosion on this pipe here, that's traveling along the ceiling of the parquet. Now, you can see the new copper pipe that's been installed over here. As I follow it along, you see that it's new, 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 and then they've actually got some hex piping that's been attached to it. Now again, that pipe at the right side, it's got that green corrosion on it, and it's showing serious signs of deterioration. It's going to need to all be replaced, much like all this right here. At some point, it's had some work done on it. Let me show you a couple other areas. Here's the pipes coming out of the mechanical room on the other side. Again, that green corrosion and some PEX piping. A lot of mixture of different types of pipes in here. You can see this area right here. Looks like there's been some serious work on not just the actual copper piping, but on the discharge piping, the sewer piping as well. You can see these P-traps. I'm actually in the parkade and there's it's quite cold in here and all of these pipes with this hot and cold water line running through it are not insulated. There's a potential here that these things could freeze as well. Again, we've got a whole combination of all this different piping. I'm going to have to make my client aware that all the piping throughout this building, all the domestic cold and hot water, could potentially cost them tens of thousands of dollars to replace. Over here is interesting. I actually found an active leak and this is underneath the suite that I'm here to inspect. Wondering exactly where this water is coming from. See it dripping on the floor. So, if you're looking to buy into a condominium, a townhome, or a home, understand that copper piping has a service life depending on the type of copper piping it is. Galvanic corrosion will cause premature deterioration. So, if you can actually see some of the copper in your home, get away those dissimilar metals that could be touching it that will cause galvanic corrosion. If you know anyone looking to purchase a home in the greater Vancouver area, pass along my contact information. I'm Tom Monroe of Monroe Home Inspections. With MHI, it's certified.